<laughs> this team did. How proud were you as far as uh, how part of the team? Was? I mean, it was it was so special. I mean, obviously, I would have loved to have been out there. Would have done anything to be out there with these guys during this playoff run. But you know, we're such a close team. Felt like I was I was still playing with with how special this group is, and it was just a lot of fun. Um, just kind of shows the character in this room. Being down two nothing in the first round seems like. You know, maybe we would, we're would we going to have a pretty quick playoff run. And to come back from that and then just keep that momentum rolling, get to play three series, go to a conference final, um, it was just really, really cool to see. And I was just so happy for, for everyone on this team. And um, I just love this group of guys. It's, I don't know if I've ever been nervous like that in my life. Um, I never get nervous when I play, but something about being in the stands and not being able to – to control any of the outcome, you know, it makes it makes me nervous. That I, I don't know if I've ever felt like that before. So, uh, it, it definitely it was definitely tough watching, but uh, you know, I'd rather be watching than, than being at home. So it, it was great. Such a great start to the year. You were you were running away with everything, and, and uh, did that make it even more disappointing that you weren't able to finish the season? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I thought, you know, from the start of the year to to right before I kind of got injured, I thought I was. You know, I was kind of getting better. Um, I thought I was playing my best hockey, kind of at, at the point when I got hurt. So it was it was definitely really frustrating to to go through that and you know miss out on the on the best time of the year, which is which is the playoffs. And uh, so it was definitely really frustrating. But uh, you know, I sometimes you just can't control things like that. It sucks. Coming along with the injury, are you going to be ready for training camp? Yeah, I'm ready for training camp. Um, I think there's actually a good chance I would be able to play in the finals. If, if we would have got there. So uh, everything's been going great. Uh, Got to give a lot of credit to, to our training staff and, and our strength and conditioning coach Craves. Uh, I, I think I would have been ready to go uh, pretty soon. And, and so a lot of credit goes to them. Uh, put in so much time with me, making sure that, you know, I'm, I'm as good as I can be. So uh, really thankful for, for the group of support staff that, that have been really, really helpful for me. Anything lined up for uh, over the summer to help you get back into game condition? Uh, just just kind of the usual guy I work out with back home. Um, and there's a physiotherapist that I work with whenever I'm you know injured in the summer too. So yeah, I got a you know good group of people back home that that I'll be able to train with and, and skate with. So uh, I'm excited. I'll just be at home all summer with with them, trying to get ready for training camp next year. And. Again, I've asked every, uh, every one of the players about the camaraderie on this team, the, the special bonding. Is the same for you, one of the best teams you've ever been with? Yeah, yeah, it's it's really special, the culture that that we have here. And, you know, it starts you know with the leadership group, with the coaching staff, uh, just bringing in good people and, and just having a, a good group of older guys. Um, I've been pretty fortunate. You know, a couple of teams I've been on here have been, have been really close and, I know it's the only organization I played in, but from what I hear, it's it's not like this everywhere. And uh, so definitely, I don't think any of us took that for granted. You know, just how special and how close everyone was with this group. Uh, you know, it's it's really sad. You know, when when something like this comes to an end, and you know, you're saying your goodbyes for the last time. You know, you never know if you're going to see a lot of these guys again. So, uh, you know, I'm going to miss it for sure, and just you know, blessed to blessed to be able to be around these guys every single day. Last season, if you think guys about guys like the Turkey and Quinn and stuff like that, how much they improved, and of course you do from the first half to the second half of the season. Now you watch it this year, uh, maybe a little bit in the first half because you've been watching what the improvement of the guys like that. You know, I'm saying you know, that you need to have to say you improve the first half to the second half of the year. It starts out with a lot of things. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. Um, it's just cool to see. Know how hard they work every single day and you know the extra work they're putting in in the basement you know in the shooting room and and with weights and to see that translate see them get used to you know north american ice and you know for those guys coming over from europe uh just the the whole you know lifestyle adjustment for them you know moving away from home and it's it's cool to see them have success and you know if if those younger guys you know didn't improve like they did there's no way we would have been able to go on a, a run like like this and you know if if they didn't, yeah, like I said, if they didn't improve, you know, we would have been in a tough spot in the playoffs. But uh, you know, credit goes to 
you know, everyone on this team, you know, all the young guys, you know, even Cozy and Cedarquist and Kisa, you know, literally everyone improved so much. And, and I think that's, that's why we were able to, you know, get to playing into June. So uh, it was awesome. They're, they're great people. And so we're really happy for them. Yeah, it's a tremendous first half of the season. And so sorry you couldn't play in the second half, but uh, uh, we sure missed you. I'll tell you that. You're a very important part of this team. So I uh, wish you all the best in your 